Okay, how's that? Same thing here. This is not working. Game sound. Uh, there we go. Whew. So, I was, uh, I was, like, finishing getting ready, and, um... Like, I was closing drawers to the uh, the dresser, and I heard something crash. And I went out into the living room, and I, was, I asked my wife, I'm like, did did you drop something? What What's going on? And I was confused, and so I thought nothing of it. Um, until I walked into the streaming room, and my green screen had collapsed on top of my desk, and apparently it threw literally everything off. Like, it unplugged my uh, my audio mixer, it unplugged my, uh, my camera, and uh, yeah, nothing worked. So, that was fun. Take a look at these uh, notes of the old patch variety. That happened, any guess why it happened? Yes, I forgot to. So, over the weekend, I packed my, uh, my green screen away. And it has a little, like, slide-out uh, stand that I forgot that, like, packs in when I uh, move it aside. And uh, I forgot to actually set up the stand so that it was stable. So it was 100% my fault. And I think the ceiling fan just kind of took it over. All right, let's take a look. Uh, Brute is pretty much what we predicted on the podcast uh, for the same reason that they said here. Makes sense. Alusia. Again, as anticipated, swap hands, or replace your hand with a copy of your opponent's until the end of turn. Yeah, that's kind of bad. I think she could probably just go to two mana now. Right, like, this card is just kind of unplayable at the moment, isn't it? They may have killed a Lucia. That's probably, I mean, that's what people wanted, especially in Standard. She may go back when she rotates because she isn't that toxic and wild, but I don't think she's a healthy card uh, with a um, Shadow Aggro Priest as a possibility. Perpetual Flame went to two. I think uh, Corb predicted this on the podcast. Just because it's too good. Uh, Tame the Flames. This is the third stage. Okay, so Corb was thinking the first stage, and I was kind of with him, because the first stage seems like the only one that's relevant, at least in Wild, but in Standard, I suppose it's a little bit different. So you just get Brucan a little bit slower. I mean, it's not often played. Demon Seed is getting changed. And Banned. I wonder if this change, plus the Mithril Rod, plus Crystallizer, would have been enough to essentially <clears throat> ban it in Wild. Did I change your stream title? I do not, actually. That is where you were wrong, because this is not yet live. Maybe should have held off on a ban for... Eh. Honestly, I, like, I don't know. Grexor, thank you for the six months. Ralphie, you inspired me to pick up Hearthstone again for the first time in over a year. Proud to say I am slightly altered version of your even locked to legend. Congrats. I've never done it in a while before. Thanks for all the great content. Well, well done. I think that's uh, a deck that's maybe well positioned to continue being good, so uh, it's a good time to learn it. And Scarlet Bird, thank you for the eight months. Almost time for another hilarious and original baby joke. I'm laughing already. Uh, thanks for the amazing content. Thank you for the eight months of support. Um... So it went from 6 to 8, and then 7 to 8 in the early stages. Honestly, I, I, I'm i fine with just banning it. Just ban it. Just ban it. Let people play Reno decks again. Let the other quest lines actually have counterplay. Like, I, I, I'm fine with banning it, even with these changes. Mithril Rod, kind of as anticipated. This card's way too good. Uh, buffs, Leatherworking Kit, still a bad card. Oh, you draw a card. I didn't even know what this card did. It seems so bad. But it's bad. Selective Breeder is now 
playable? Boar Hunter? Kevin the Bro, thank you for the thousand bits. We finally got through a Warlock Stone? I know. I know. I have one final... Wait. I have one final day of conceding to Warlocks, and then tomorrow I get to have fun again. Wildfire now playable in Odd Mage. And Rip Even Mage, yeah. That's actually a big hit to Even Mage. Like, this card kind of carried the deck. They buffed a pirate. They buffed a pirate. Oh my god, they buffed a pirate. Um, this is probably the one that's most relevant. Oof. Why does a 1-mana 2-2 two -two have an, a battle cry effect? That's kind of concerning. Because it's a class card, I know, but like, uh, even the, um... Enchanted Raven was, like, a good card at a... Yeah, I mean, that's just the nature of power creep, I suppose. <laughs> because, we, it, like, it used to just be that a, a vanilla 1-mana 2-2 two -two is just good on one. But no longer the case. Uh, I don't know if this makes it playable. Right? Like, you really, you really would just want, like, a boatload of 1-mana pirates in the questline version. I think this is the only relevant change. One card isn't going to make or break things. It does make it significantly better, especially in, like, mirror matches. You can no longer just trade your patches into this, which is a, a really big deal. So, I don't know. This card concerns me. But, like, pirate, like, I, we talked, I wasn't expecting this many pirates change. Uh, we talked about it on the podcast, and, like, it was, it was likely that Pirate Warrior gets buffs for, uh, standard. Because it's bad. There, and was, like, exactly what they described in terms of what they were going to, uh, buff. Glad they didn't buff the quest. Yeah, I, who was it? I think Meowth was <laughs> throwing that as a, as a possibility, and I don't think that's realistic, like, that just creates mega problems. You know what I'm going to play when the patch drops? What are you going to play? Galaka Crawler? <laughs> D's nut. Oh, God. Gonna have to remove VIP from Facepalm. Bean Overlord, no more even mage rip. I mean, you can still play it, it's just bad. You, you... I mean, it kind of defeats the purpose of running the Reckless Experimenter as well. So, I don't know. Do we have the, uh, the command updated for the new patch notes? Or is that something that I have to do? Seems like you guys predicted it well on the podcast. Zeker, thank you for the six months. Yeah, uh, some of the, like, the... I didn't think they are going to change the, uh... The Demon Seed and nerf it. So that was a bit of a surprise. Um... But most things were pretty clear. Um, I was a little bit surprised that... Shaman got hit twice, and I was thinking that the Demon Under quest might get hit over the Shaman one. But I think Corb, um, Corb has a better read on the standard metagame than me, so he was probably right. Um, you know who got it 100% correct, though? Is uh, Zach O from the Vicious Syndicate. Like, literally card for card, he got every single one. My name is H. Thank you for the six months. Like, Warlock, Mithril Rod to 4, and Demon Seed. Shaman, Perpetual Flame to 2, and Command the Elements. Demon Hunter, Ironbound Brute to 8. Priest, Elusia Effect, Change. Demon Seed, Band, and Wild. Literally got every single one correct. And he's pretty consistent on that, too. Like, usually he gets, uh, you know, over 50%. But getting every single one is pretty impressive.
We got the hunter weapon change. I mean, you literally can never predict nerfs because uh, they are completely unpredictable by their nature. What do you think Lucia will do now? Uh, I don't have to guess. It's she just copies your opponent's hand instead of stealing it, so she's probably not going to be used in a very many decks. Does it still justify a spot in Reno Priest? I doubt it. Unless you want to counter combo the opponents with their own combo. So it's good into like APM Mage or um, Tog Druid or like Combo Druid. But at the same time, like, no. <laughs> because they kill you when they have the combo. Is one additional card for Shaman Quest really that big of a deal? Yes. I mean, the Shaman Quest is terrible in Wild anyway. So I don't think it's that relevant in our format. But like, yeah. Theoretically, required. not only is it one card that requires you to complete the quest, but it's one less card that gets Brucanned. Honestly, I was hoping Elysia still swaps hands, just swap back at the end of turn. Yeah, that would be probably closer, so you could at least, like, dump combo pieces and remove them. I don't know, without denying the opponent, like, their big mass removal. All right, folks, the deck is Shadow Thief Priest. The goal of the deck is honestly to play both Archbishop Benedictus in a single deck. But we have a lot of death rattles that steal cards from our opponent that we can draw with Dead Ringer and Loot Hoarder. And then bring back with Twilight's Call to get additional cards from our opponent's deck. If you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can catch me live at twitch.tv slash Raffle. All right. Let's see how many Warlocks we concede to today. Hey, welcome, Arky. Biscuit. I forget to press a button. Biscout, thank you for the 12 months. Happy one year, Raffle. Keep up the great content. Well, thank you. Kevin the Bro, thank you for the 100 bits. What do you think about the Elysia change? I think it makes it for a healthier card, but it's significantly worse. Uh, the card was super toxic, especially in Standard, and um, the way it's being used, I don't think is how it's, like, was its intended purpose, you know? I'm currently using Chandler Ignite deck. What do you think I should add to that deck? I don't... What? I Chandler and Ignite seem like good cards to add to that deck. Um. <laughs> There's no possible human way for me to answer that question. Uh, let's play the conditional card drop first. Maybe it'll be um, Shutterwalk Shaman and we'll get to Benedictus the Shutterwalk. Like to upgrade it to get it better. I I, get, I don't know what cards you're currently running, so how can I make I I can't answer. What? <laughs> let's, I, I, I can't. I can't. With the information you've provided, I can't, I, I can't help you. No old quest. Nope, that would break the deck entirely. Bonk.
Oh, it's Big Shaman. Okay, well, the uh, Psychic Scream's actually helpful. Ooh. Not sure how helpful that is, but Psychic Scream's good, at least. I don't think I want to kill that yet, do I? Probably look for a... Uh, I can scream like a Oracle or even a Dead Ringer into their deck to mess up their uh, their Resurrect pool, their Muck Morpher pool. Ooh, actually, that scheme scheme. I have scream. They have scheme. Yeah, here's what we're gonna do. Absolutely nothing. Because I don't want this to die, and I want a Psychic Scream next turn. I mean, they've already played one Muck Morpher, so this doesn't matter that much. It just... It could. And... If I get to Benedictus, it allows me to steal a Colossus, potentially. Friendly minion... Okay, that's not bad. Mind if I roll me? Job done. Cool. Really hope the opponent's running Hex. <laughs> you know? That would help me out a lot. Again? For some Garbo in there. Deck. Steam is at five, so it's almost good. I'm sorry, what? Didn't I backfire horribly? I mean, not horribly, but at least somewhat. I think I just need to heal up a fair amount here. Three here here. There is no light, only power for vengeance. Draw two. Can this even get me? Another Twilight's call? Another palm reading. 
couple of hysteria is probably fine. Gonna need it. Okay. Hey, Big D Gamer Boy! Wait, what? Was that good? I'm gonna go with no. Well, it was not. I feel like the opponent was ahead there. Benny? Nice. Another scheme, perhaps? Nope. What happens if you combine Dark Bishop and Baku in the whole in the same deck? Uh not very much. Wonder if a hero power mage independent of Genabaku will emerge. There's already some Reno versions that uh, existed prior to the uh, change. Opponent seems to be in trouble here. Make things worse. Our deck now. I'm actually going to save this in case I get uh, Scrapyard Colossus going. Awesome. Ian, thank you for the five dollar tip in Rock Coin. Heard on State of Wild Discord, every time Warlock is tier one, they nerf to Oblivion, but when it's not Warlock, they leave it slide for years. Also, isn't isn't Awaken Makers in this deck? I made sure to I had to make sure that I asked you about this. Yeah. It's now the second time I've been asked about that. But there's some certainly some takes that uh happen in the State of Wild Discord. Uh, this guarantees a big minion, right? Yeah. Obliterate good. looking pretty good too. I don't know what this is going to do, but it seems fun. <laughs> Oof. Good thing I wasn't at three health. Wow! Uh 
Uh oh. Oh no. I could go horribly wrong. It did. That's a high roll. The low roll. Taskless, thank you for the 24 months. 24 months, that's almost two years. So happy to be here, keep up the good work. Well, thank you, happy to have you. That is a lot of resources to not accomplish very much, isn't it? I forgot I had the muck marker in hand. You have bet. Whoa! Holy quests, Batman. Anduin versus the Frost. You have bet. Easy. Hey, shot. I must protect the one. The light shall bring victory. Hmm. It's gonna be tough if it's a combo druid, isn't it? Unless I assemble their combo before them. Uh, let's look for minions. That seem more important. Patch is live yet. Uh, no, they are tomorrow, as was scheduled last week. Why did Raffle concede against Warlock? Because it's in the t title, so I have to. Did they answer the question? The deck's getting deleted tomorrow. Our deck. Raffle, why without old quest? Old quest. Uh, because it would break the deck. And my deck would no longer do what it's entirely built to do. You think Evenlock will make a comeback after the nerfs? Uh, it didn't go anywhere. It's one of the top five decks, according to one of the Blizzard data scientists. Prior to the ban and changes, so. No, it won't make a comeback because it's one of the best decks prior to the changes. Don't leave me. Uh, none of these cards really do anything. Fortunately, none of the opponent's cards have done anything yet, but, like, I think they just beat me if they are a combo. So, let's find out. Minion. Nice. Uh, 
Touch avoided the nurse, that's odd. I mean... They nerfed the quest line and... What? I mean... Yeah, it's a powerful card, but like... Rod was always going to be ahead of Touch in terms of uh, nerfs and like... You don't need to delete Warlock entirely from standard. It's unlikely, but maybe I can out -ar armor a Maligos. Does the quest break Benedictus even though it starts in your hand? Yes, in the same way that quest breaks uh, Gen or um, or Gen. <laughs> And also Gan. I don't know. I thought there was another example in there somewhere that there isn't. Stereo clears, yeah, but I don't really feel the need to clear. Uh, GG, I guess. Kind of slow, at least. I mean, I was kind of joking when I talked about uh, out armoring Mali Ghost, but like, got a lot of health. Deck runs Malfurion. Is this a UI? I can scream these back into their deck. And maybe try and fish for another alignment to reset their mana. I don't have a way to do that though. Oh. Yeah, this is fine. Oh no, they're ahead in fatigue. Anyway. I hope 54 is enough. Why are they running Mana Saber and the Marauder? Wait, couldn't that hit another UI? Isn't that really dangerous? I guess they're going to play more spells, but still. Reno list? They've played a boatload of uh, duplicates already, including that one. Alright, I 
I need to find another psychic scream, it looks like. There it is. See you later. I'm the armor deck now. Oh, I guess you're still the armor deck. I was wrong, I'm sorry. Gonna be hard to corrupt this though. I'm assuming it's not a combo if they're drawing this aggressively, right? I don't know. Oh my god. Death is eternal. <laughs> my turn is not. Uh, I gotta go here to uh, kill the mana saber and avoid dying. Jits, thank you for the extending that tier one sub through next month. I haven't hit the Benedictus yet, which is Kind of a problem, but I think it just might be Jade. Their combo? I have no idea. I think that they're running they're running too many cards to have a combo, right? We've seen double Marauder, single Mana Saber, double UI, one Overflow. Yeah, Mechathune's the only thing that makes some sense. But there goes the poison seeds now. I think it's Jade. I hope it's Jade. <laughs> Because if it's not Jade, it kind of makes the Archbishop Benedictus a Oh, it's Tog? That's a problem. Forgot Tog was a thing. Ian, thank you for a $5 tip in Rothcoin. It's election day for Canada. So do all the Canadians in Raffle's chat today please go out and vote? This match is brought to you by Ian and in no way f reflects the views of Raffle. Yes, but I endorse this message. So do go out there and vote. All right, here's what we're going to do. Look for the Benny. I 
I want to play this first to add another oracle to the pool. Ugh. Okay, that did not work. Yeah, that definitely didn't work. Okay. Oh no. Can we ask who you vote for or is that too personal? I mean, can't ask. Won't necessarily answer. It's also not as though I keep my... Like it shouldn't be that hard to intuit my uh, political leanings, I don't think. People do it all the time when they spam my channel with hateful comments. All right, I need one of those four to be Benny. And I also need the Thalnos, even though it draws me a card here. Just drew it? I mean, not necessarily. There was a, um, we know that there was a, a dead ringer in their deck as well. Anduin versus Anduin. Light makes right, the light shall bring victory. I think I have to keep the Spirit Lash, just assuming it's a uh, aggro priest. But if it's not, you got a Thought Seize. Oh god. Oh no, I lose. I like I can't beat this deck. Is Rat good in Pirate Warrior? What Rat? I'm going to go with no, since I can't think of a card with the word rat in it that would be good in Pirate Warrior. Rat King? Okay, yeah, that one makes sense. Uh, let's actually go fishing for cards from their deck maybe next turn. Um... It's just going to be hard to go faster than them, because I'm also going to dilute my res pool. Uh, concern? Maybe I just don't play minions until I get to scream? I can't even get a boar from their deck anymore. Yeah, I, I can't win. That's... You have bet. Two cost taunt. It, that's not what the card says, though. Nope. Have 
doing versus Lady Presto. Well, well, if it isn't Varen's precious son. The light shall bring victory. Ignite Mage is going to be impossible. So hopefully it's Reno or Secret Mage. Hi. Greetings. Greetings. Alright. Double ringer. Okay. Find out soon what's in their deck, I think. But it kind of looks like uh, Ignite, unfortunately. So unless I steal their combo, it's going to be tough. Yeah, we lose. JP. Don't leave me. It's too bad. Um, I can try to assemble their combo, but it seems unlikely. Is Ignite better than Mizaki now? Um, seems faster, so probably. Generally fast is good. Overdrawing is not a huge concern. I only have three uh, death rattles in my deck anyway. And I just desperately need to get to the oracles so that um, I can get the opponent's cards and hopefully reduce them with the uh, bomb rating. Some baby brain takes in chat. There you go. Thank you, my dear. If you compare the amount of care Hearthstone received a few years back versus now, it's obvious. Yeah. Yeah, they make more frequent changes now, which would indicate that they care more now. You're welcome. They drew two minions there, didn't they? Remember when it took two years to nerf patches or Aviana Coon or Giants Warlock or is that is that the heyday you were talking about? 
I'm so I'm sorry. Is Dirty Rat good in Pirate? No, Dirty Rat is absolutely not good in Pirate Warrior. Nothing that that card does is what Pirate Warrior wants to do. What? I don't. I'm gonna find. I don't have. Uh, maybe another palm reading here. Cool. There we go. Yep. My hand is too. You are so very kind. I'll be just like you. We're dead. Seems like we're dead. Wait, those were the minions they drew? Thank you, my dear. I hope they botch this and we get the laugh, but it's unlikely. We all have our disguises. That's GG. You have better. Even if we did assemble their combo, they just win because they have an ice block. friends. Yeah, the opponent was really proud of themselves. I think one visions is probably enough just for, for something to do on turn two. That's something better to do on turn two. Warlocks. Uh, probably want to save the coin for Mass Hysteria then. You know what? Priest hasn't seen action in a while. Thief Priest. Yeah, I also haven't seen any Murloc Shamans on Ladder recently. Decks so you think are shaping up to look good this patch? Um, all of the decks that were good before the patch, minus seed lock plus decks that uh, got bullied out of by seed lock. So things like Reno could come back, but they're gonna have a harder time against Pirate Warrior because of uh, the inevitability that the Juggernaut provides. That's uh, concerning. Pirate Warrior and Og Questioner are the two best decks now. It's impossible to say, but I don't think that Questline Hunter is as good as people think it is, and I think it's super fragile. And the decks that got bullied by Seedlock are just capable of hard farming uh, Questline Hunter. So. Like, if Questline Hunter is the best deck, it's really, really, really easy to counter. Have I 
All right. I mean, take is the secret mage won't get past tier three. I mean, secret mage helps keep ignite mage in check, or at least it used to. I don't know. When a deck like falls off as much as secret mage does, people tend not to go back to it, even if it uh, gets good again. At least they're board locked. But. Wasn't Pirate Warrior one of the best decks, but never saw a play until Quest? Yes, except it also saw a lot of play because it was one of the best decks. I don't know the best way to do this, so let's hope this works. Worst outcome. You think it's still worth the run Sir Finley Empire Warrior? It hasn't been for years, no. Especially now with the quest. It just does not... It's one less pirate that you could be running. Get your card draw from Ankar, which is the best card in your deck. I'm not going to survive long enough to get there. Technically not dead, but very likely dead. Think people using abusing animation cancel should get banned, same as Snip Snap. Um, I mean, the precedent is there, probably. I don't know that people were for Snip Snap, but I think it's really scummy to do, regardless. You have bet and but they seem to have changed their stance with the um, the Cthulhu bug abuse, so I don't know. But at the same time, I would. Uh, I don't know just shouldn't that kind of thing it's kind of the same thing with like battlegrounds people were doing it and i don't know they didn't seem to take action but still kind of scummy does benny require at least one shadow spell to proc its effect i have no idea i've never tried it without any spells it's The Shaman Nurse be significant? Probably not. I mean, it makes the deck a lot worse, especially in Standard, but like it's not really a good deck in Wild, in my opinion. Uh, if this is Questline Hunter, I don't know how I win. Is it still possible that Hearthstone nerf Ilganoth again instead of Brute? No, because they announced the nerfs. And also, why would, there's no reason to nerf Ilganoth again. Brute is an obvious problem. It's the only card that does anything. What is this deck's win condition? Uh, we make our opponent's life total zero. I 
Ideally, before the opponent does the same to us, which is difficult. And <gasps> Job done. So is this the only time in Hearthstone history a card got banned from Wild? I can only remember Gen and Baku being Hall of Famed. Um, like two months ago, one got banned. And uh, Gen and Baku weren't a ban, they were just Hall of Famed, which is different. God, I'm just gonna get farmed by this. Unless I get like a big Thanos board with the uh, Twilight's Call. But like, everything that I do just gets beat by this opponent's deck. I wish Twitch chat had access to Google. I feel that. Uh, damage is permanent in this matchup, so I might as well take that. Their way to report odd warrior ropers. Yes, so you what you do is you go to www.google.com and uh, type that same question. Maybe Big Spook can save me. Then I missed the fact that I had a dead ringer in there. That was dumb. Looks like they're buffing a couple cards that are already strong in Pirate Warrior. Just one. Which is a significant one, but just one. one health it's not the end of the world it's a really big deal though because again you can't trade your own patches into it so this very significant change that's really bad for me Or they buff something already in a super strong deck, SMH my head. They didn't. They buffed it for standard. And Pirate Warrior is Omega Bad standard. Hello Mino, thank you for the two months. Yeah, second rapid fire is brutal. So it's not buffed in wild? It is buffed in wild, but like the buff wasn't for wild. So their intention wasn't to buff something that's already in a very strong deck. They just weren't buffing it for the format. They make balance changes for standard, not wild. They always have. Anduin versus Trixar. Let the hunt begin. I understand the nurse, but the only buffs that make sense is the mage buffs. Well, I mean the hunter buffs make sense too, because those cards were trash. 
I can't beat Questline Hunter <laughs> with this deck, unfortunately. So that might just add to my list of uh, concede decks. What do you think getting to Legend from Diamond Heart at 5 is hard? No, I just don't have any desire to get the Legend from here. If you can get to Diamond 5, you typically can get to Legend as well. 100 buffs won't do anything? It'll make me play the, uh, I mean, the 2-mana card's good. The, the Beast fetch. Oh. This gives me a little bit more time than Odd, so maybe I can set up cards. Guys, quit <laughs> quit being babies and just wait for the patch to come out before you complain. How about that? Uh, this can help with the Thaunus, which is probably the only way I survive. YouTube comments section wouldn't complain like this, would they? Absolutely, they would and do. People are mostly the same no matter where you go. Hey, turn. What is YouTube? I don't know. Google it. Gotta be flash heal, right? I'm making some solid, solid prog progress on this side quest, aren't I? It's just a card in their deck, so no, they're just saving this for uh, the Tavish. I don't want to attack into Explosive Trap. That's a card from their deck.
consider. You dead? It's not entirely true. We'll be back shortly. I'm gonna take a quick break.
Unique Flow Snake. I'll give you the one year. Do this quickly while he's AFK, you won't notice. What you think? I'll give her the one year of support. Ooh, Demon Hunter could be fun. The Legion's rage pales before mine. The light shall bring victory. Finish my hunt. Greetings. Greetings. The first priest quest would be good in this deck. No, it would not. I can assure you that. I think it's a little bit too greedy to try and get a card draw off of that. This deck is not playable. Give me another one. I mean, I'm playing it right now, so it seems pretty playable. Also, uh... Maybe you should try being less demanding and people might be more inclined to cooperate with what you are saying. Let's uh let's remove that timeout. That person's funny because they're sad. It's good content for me. I appreciate the effort though, Swag. I just wanted to troll them a little bit more. I mean, they can still view the stream? Yeah, but they can't drop garbage takes like that. <laughs> so where's the fun for me? Wait, why is that created by? That's just like in their deck, right? So the sigil didn't create it, they just... Oh, thank you for the eight months. Please use these funds to do whatever the heck you want. I will, thank you. Appreciate that support. Uh, let's actually kill that because I have a lot of card draw in my deck, don't I? Like this. Sigil is weird. Sigils in general are kind of weird, but like it's what happens with a 
new and uh no uh unique uh mechanic like that it's weird to see the watch post attack urine comes now but i just went to the bathroom Benny! And the other card. <laughs> yep. They ha the leftmost card could be a skull because it's an Illidari Studies card that they've been holding for a long time. We're oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> urine just keeps coming. You had to glide me again? Okay. Okay, we're good. I hope. Unfortunately, the Curtis comes down next turn. That might be a problem. Don't leave me. Uh, how do I want to do this? I don't want to bump both of these in, right? Do I just go like on the hysteria without attacking? Because I want this to have a hefty health total so that it can like bash into this and other things. I don't know. <laughs> okay, sure. Yep. Wait, what? No! No, that's not what I wanted! <laughs> oh, dear God. Why? fine. <laughs> Thanks, deck. Yeah, get out of here, Curtis. Job done. Oh my god, there's going to be so much cost reduction now. Do you see what no! I no! I don't see anything! If I don't look, it doesn't happen. I, see. I don't see. So we won, right?
Yeah, easy one. Thank you. Anduin versus Jaina. You asked for it. The light shall bring victory. This deck might be a meta breaker, yeah. Yeah, that involves our hero portrait breaking repeatedly. In the metagame. I'm sorry, what? No. Never seen that card in Mage before. Mythic, thank you for the nine months. Appreciate that. Visible confusion? I feel like it's justified visible confusion. Glitchy. Thank you for the two months. Yeah, let's look for... Insight? I want the Twilight... No, I'm going to go for the Twilight's Call. The Insight is really tempting because we were playing the Palm Readings. But since this is Shadow Visions and not Thrive, I want multiple copies of Twilight's Call. It's a rogue? Oh! Chat, you might be right for once. Not this time, though. <laughs> Get wrecked! Alright. I've got two of these. Hey! Another Twilight's Call. I mean, that's almost certainly a uh, rigged fair game, right? And I'm going to get blasted here. Told you. All right. <laughs> Chat and I are both 0 for 1. We're going to get any better guessing the rogue, are we? No. You're... It's just Secret Mage with an initiate in it? Why, though? I don't know what that secret is. I was expecting, <laughs> jeez. I was expecting explosive there. Maybe it's a Reno secret? Or just, yeah, maybe a budget secret. Uh, either way, I think this is probably good to get some healing. We do be calling the Twilights though. Okay, it's just funny at this point, so. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Every discover was just Twilight's call. I'm late. I'm late. Explosive, so we know it's not counter. Face the light. Bonk. Cool. Is it ice block? It's ice block or ice or a uh, flame ward. Either way, it's a problem for future raffle. Whoa. Oh my god, these raised deads are not ideal. Okay. Pheasant? I mean, it's just gotta be Reno here, right? I need to find the um, Spirit Lash, so I want to hold on to the Thalnos if I can.
I also could have hero powered that, but I don't feel like I'm under that much pressure. No, it's not Reno. <laughs> it is, in fact, not Reno. Why isn't it Reno, though? Alright, I gotta start hero powering their face. Spell. Want to get the reliquary? And we know it's not. Uh, I don't need to worry about hero power and face because we tested the new secret already. Cool. We got our Reno. Benny? I need to hear a power face though. Usually. They're here. It's explosive, I can play the Benny. Not. I haven't tested for counter yet, so let's do that. Cool. Doesn't draw anything. So I think we uh, bump the scientist, go face with this, then play the Benny. No. Might as well just double trade and here first. Oh, I forgot that was a secret. I always forget that's a secret. You know, here for the explosive, because I don't have a seance anyway. And uh, we just set up for a fatigue victory. That is a fireball hitting my minion. Uh, I think I want to lead with this, play this, and this. Oh. Maybe I want to, like, I'm weak to counterspell, though. I don't think I get the uh, Cloud Prince down here. I think I just have to go for it. Yeah. Unfortunate. Good God. You can be whatever you want. Okay. Could be worse. More pheasants. And we know it, it, that that's still the first secret that they uh, had.
I overdraw here, but I don't think that matters unless it's the Reliquary Prime, and even then it seems unlikely to matter. What is it? What is it? All right, this is probably our last turn. That doesn't draw me anything. Counter spell might have been nice. Explosive is good here. Order? I'm late. I'm late. Yeah, I would have had one extra health on the uh Cloud Prince. Or it could have rather. It's a fireball. It might actually matter here if uh this is flame ward. Whoops. What is it? What is it? What is it? What is it, chat? I'm hoping to find an ice block, so I, I don't think I want more nether one portals. Need a secret. Apparently, this is the only one left in my deck. Right, oh. I guess I had um, lethal this turn, but this is much more fun. I was just thinking about whether or not they even had that card in their deck. Need that conjure value? I just wanted a, a repeat of uh, of like playing the same card multiple times, but I guess it worked the same way with the fireball, right? We just won't show that we had the fireball in hand. Save face here. Lucia nerf is so sad. Is it? Seems like a thing that everybody was begging for for months now. Anduin versus Anduin. I will protect the alliance. The light shall bring victory. A lot of Elusia enjoyers suddenly? Yeah, I've, I've, I'm noticing that too. Like, <laughs> where did they come from? Where did they go? Oh, okay, if this is boar, then maybe I can uh, snag some boars with this hand. Hello there. Greetings. Greetings. Isn't she useful in an aggro mirror? Oh god. Oh god. Uh, this gives the opponent an advantage unless I can steal some seances, right? <laughs> oh, see, it's like I'm running the quest. Boar? I don't think Boar wants to run the quest. Mind if I roll or death rattles that aren't Boar.
Okay, I think one seance is probably enough, but... Eh. Let's uh, get a... Maybe one of those. I, I was trying to find Insight. Or doesn't want to run quest? No, it wants to end the game, not... It's only one loot order, though, right? Mind if I roll need? Like, the good versions of the board deck have been cutting the quest and just, like, hyper fixating on uh, completing the... getting the weapon online, because that's how you win the game. Really glad that the opponent's cards are so synergistic with mine. Mind if I roll need? Where do you get your decks? Usually from Hearthstone after I build them in Hearthstone. Wow. Really? Wow. All right. Uh, bump here, because this could get me a spell. It did. Vivid Nightmare? Vivid Nightmare seems fun. Seems a little redundant with uh, what I got going. One insight. Bird. Turn this uh, dead ringer into a pit fighter. Wait, is it Weasel Priest? Is this game just going to be going on forever? I mean, I'm into it. We need some weasels as well. If the opponent is running them, we have them. Mind if I roll need? See, the thing about my deck is that it allows me to share decks with the opponent. Here. 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 Okay. I still need to find my Benny. And I need to consider holding a seance for the uh for the Benedictus for extra fun so I can make a real big fat deck. It does need to heal. Okay. They healed themselves right into some birds. How did that happen? Not quite within sight. Benny? <laughs> close. Very, very close. Unfortunately, this damage does not remain permanent. That's a good burn, though. You are safe now. Seance? Hmm. If only I had one of those. Instead, I have two.
Okay, I'm halfway through my deck. Any time now, I should draw the bunny. Birds hit each other? Hmm! Not gonna say on to your Amara, I already did. I literal seconds ago I talked about how I'm saving this for Benny. I'm gonna save the Thalnos for the flash potentially. There's also the potential that they're running Nazoth, and I could say on that. Got two more death rattles in my deck. This looks like their second Spirit Lash. For a lot of healing. Which is what I'm saving mine for. Wait, we actually do two death rounds there. Weasel. This is not the Benny I want to seance, but it's good to get him out of my deck. It's also good to bash the opponent in the head for eight. Okay. Uh, I can also, like, another reason why I'm not in a big hurry to seance my Amara is I can scream a Benedictus. Or I can scream their second Amara into their deck and then Benedictus it, so. Just, like, not terribly valuable. Right. Still kind of want to keep the Thalnos, but... I'm not sure if it's better than just playing it out here. I've got two Twilight's Calls left, so I can kind of make up for it. I've also got a lot of AoE removal. Heard. Where is Benny? We got Benny's a plenty. I don't 
think I want to play the Benedictus here because I think they play the Amara soon. And I want to scream, Amara, get the Benny back. Please don't have life stealing for us. Uh, is this game going to end? Nope. No, it is not. I mean, it still could. It's just going to be a while. Yep. going to be a long while. This is actually a difference maker. Hello, turn limit. This deck could end, or this game could end. I don't know what. Oh God. Wow. That is uh, fantastic for everybody involved. This is just pure chaos, right? I've got another Benedictus in my deck. So do I want dragons? Chat, do you like dragons? Hmm. Alright, let's do it. I've got another bunny. They converted their Benedictus into a dragon, so I've got the lone remaining Benedictus, right? Yep, you do. Dragon D's nuts. No! Oh, I forgot they had one in hand. Oh my god. Oh no. And... Pretty good with the uh, Spirit Lash. I don't know if it's what I want right now, though. Yeah. <laughs> Need to force the Amora so that I can scream it. But, like... The the dragons actually present or offer a win condition. There's also the potential that like I Benedictus before the press door. I don't know. Uh, the Amar is gonna die if I scream most of the time, right? Yeah, their deck is too thick. Scream into their deck, their deck is full. It doesn't work, like, it just destroys everything. But that's the last Amara, so I think it's still fine to do that. So it just turns this into Twisting Nether. And I have massive, massive hand advantage. What a great sleepy dragon. Um, that's 60, right? Yeah. Oop. Yeah, if things can't... If death rattles can't... Like, change zones, they just trigger. But they didn't get a Wax of Dread in their uh, deck, and more importantly, they didn't get a uh, Amara. Oh, 
Bird. Bird. Now you can get no fatigue. Uh, that's not how this card works, though. Do I want to keep this for the healing? I think so. Because the opponent has a hero power that actually heals. Just drew an obscene number of cards. Oh my god, what they... They turned all of those birds into dragons. If I shuffle them, they'll be full size. Yeah, not a full commitment there, but... I mean, they've got a much better hand advantage right now, which is a big deal. Like, I'm... I think I'm still behind unless I can get, like, Twilight's Calls and uh, even my own race dead. A simple spell. Like, that's huge. That's so many resources. I don't think I want to lash yet. This is... I need to hold resources. Hello there. Hi. Show these mortals your true form. Again, again. Mind if I roll need? Time may pass, but the dream is eternal. Oh my god. That Yasera is disgusting. I am the storm of your demise. That's I think the Yasera is GG. Gotta scream so that this doesn't draw. Unless I hit a Yasera or something, I'd be in big trouble for a while. But the issue is that they get a 7 6 and a 3 5 that can't be targeted, plus burst damage. So I think I just need to delay for the turn limit until I can find a way to turn the corner. Because that is mega concerning. So many resources.
Okay, that's actually a big deal. Just gotta tank some damage for a bit, but I need something good off of this. Or... Or... I could uh, take a gamble. Could go in on this now, try and rely on this as my win condition. No way it's sticking. I mean, all of their cards are dragons. Uh, the Ysera Awakens kills it, but at least we get... Get the full size one. No, oh, oh that's so bad. How come I haven't just I've got two Twilight's Call minimum in my deck still? It's good, but it gives them two cards. Like, I need the, <laughs> I need the card draw. I'm just hitting nothing but dragons. I don't like dragons anymore, chat. Jeez. Where's my card draw? Hit the Bohem Somdi. I think they had the. I think the Bohem Somdi came from the left. So I feel like it's unlikely I even uh, Bene a Bohem Somdi. Oh my god. This is unbearable. Like, I don't think I've hit a single pe like piece of card draw since the Benedictus happened. And. They've hit an obscene amount. We must stop this corruption. That's the <laughs> That's the penny. I think I'm I think I'm done so. Unless I, I have another hysteria in my deck. But at the same time, like I need the Twilight's calls. They've gotten so many of the boner drakes, too. What is this? <laughs> Job done. Man. I guess I, the, the Blom Somdi at the beginning did a real good job of thinning their deck. Which I think, again, allowed them to turn the corner. But I don't think I can recover from this. We got it, but I think it's probably a little too little too late. Death Rattle is also probably not going to solve the problem. Um, because I need something with a more immediate effect on board when I'm taking this much damage. But it's still better than not getting it. Um, I don't know if deck tracker is even functional at this point, but it looks like that was one of the ones from uh, the opponent's deck. Yeah, that was a bennied. Oh god, really just rubbing it in at this point.
Like, not only, like, I think more than half of the dragons that they've generated have, like, generated resources for them. In addition to the hitting the card draw. Alright, well, that's one less death rattle we can hit. Oops. That one coming. Save me, Thalnos. Oh my god. You fight well. Well played. Well, we finally hit our draw. <laughs> oh, that's a fitting fitting minion to close out with. <laughs> I mean, I did get pretty lucky off of the Murazon, but, like, I was just too far behind in cards. They hit, like, three Boner Drakes, um, two Emerald Drakes, uh, a Draconid Operative, a Cobalt Spellkin, a Chonker, <laughs> a Ysera. Like, yeah, all of their dragons added more resources to their hand, except for one, two... Three, four. Oh, that was quite the game, though. But man, I could not get cards back in hand to save my life. GG swag. GG. And a Deathwing if you clear the board. Jeez. I guess the the bomb somebody like really made made everything a lot easier, which is just kind of like how you built the deck. So, stuck I'm actually gonna take a quick break while that reboots and we'll return shortly It's good to see you again.
binge drinker. I give you the prime and uh, stay safe. All right, I'll wait this out in case it's even. Nope. You have best. Is this the place to cry for dust refund for my wildfire and even mage? Nope. Generally, this is not the place to cry about anything. Then I just make fun of you for being a big baby. I'm gonna save myself a few seconds here. Hey, did you guys know? Here's a quick sellout moment. That I started a uh, Eclipse channel. Go subscribe to it. And clip me doing funny things. And then they will appear on the Clips channel. Uh, palm reading good, pot steel good. Both most card is kept? But it's odd paladin. Uh, spirit lash is good in this matchup. Probably find that spirit lash, right? Yeah, that one. <laughs> the light dims, but we fire. All right. Um. So what we're going to do first is let this die, then we can play the Raise Dead, then we can play the Spirit Lash. Mount up. Stupid. Yeah. Backstab this. Uh, that actually gives me less healing, so it's kind of unfortunate. Oh, well, they certainly had some refill. Alright. Here we. need to relieve some of the damage here because I'm almost certainly psychic screaming this next turn. So let's deny some of the uh yeah. It's 
some of the big hits. Bet the opponent hasn't missed this card. I have this a singular minion. Job done. I think uh, authority has kind of taken the place of uh, conviction after that nerf. Good God, there's another one. not the card I need here. Uh, this is, though. Reporting for duty. Reporting for duty. Reporting for duty. Reporting for duty. Oof. Hippo with wings. <laughs> Thank you for the prime. Appreciate that support. What a great name. Broom? Oh god, uh, I need to dump hand. Doing a great job of it, by the way. Cool. Uh, knowing that they have divine favor is really important, though. Reporting for duty. Reporting for duty. Did they get the oh? Down. Get two cards off of this Arcane Intellect. Honestly, not a bad card. Time for a uh, Reno Thalnos. It's getting kind of low there, right? <laughs> it probably wasn't good to do that, but I did it, so. You here for the tour? 
Hey, I'm happy to hear that, Hippo. I do remember your comment, and I appreciate you sharing that with us. These favors do be divine, though. I mean, the longer I keep the opponent in the game, the more fun I have, so. I have a board lead and I have a health total lead. What could go wrong? I was really looking for my own two arms, but... Hey, give me that. Uh, let's just do this. I almost I traded that. that. Uh, I think unless the opponent's running death rattles, I'm out of death rattles, so. Rip. Come one, come all. Reporting for duty. Reporting for duty. <laughs> More stats. I've got exotic wares and funnel cakes. Luvia, thank you for that gifted sub. This one's an ogre chat. Alright, I guess we can just close it out. <laughs> uh, with the Baku. Like, even a second two armsman isn't that good for them, is it? Eh. They haven't. No, they've got one more righteous protector. Also, 6 9. Nice. I think that deserves a lethal. Look at that, I've won two games of Hearthstone today. It's only taken two and a half hours. <laughs> oh, fantastic. I'm just gonna go for the uh, palm read in here. The old palm reading gambit, yeah. We've got shadow visions on two. Find the palm reading, get to the insights. Uh oh. Gotta go fast? Which is not what this deck is designed. Apparently, it's not what the opponent is designed to do, either. Mm. Tough turn. Give me a card. Nerd. Just gotta find some ice blocks? True, true. We can do that, right? the opponent like bothers to play the game oh right playing the spells gives them targets for stuff this game might also take an hour doubtful they're gonna just kill me hey we drew the card Uh, 
it's a really good start on their quest for them. That freezing potion is nuts, especially if they're running Lance. Nope. I don't know who Lance is, and neither does the opponent, apparently. Maybe I can get a turn 5 Benedictus? Healing might actually be important, so I'm going to go for it. I feel like I have enough card generation already. What kind of deck is this? Uh, <laughs> not a good one. It's just uh, an excuse to play double Benedictus. We're looking to uh, steal our opponent's cards. What to do? And figure it out from there. Do what to do. One fire spell. Kevin the Bro. Give for the one thousand bits. Is there any way you would want the spirit and Bosomdi stuff in this deck? Um Ooh, we actually drew the bunny, didn't we? I don't think it would quite work because I only have like a th I would need to add different cards to the deck that would be worthwhile bringing back. Like, Twilight's Call does a good enough job as it is. <laughs> I mean, that's two chances of an ice block, right? Don't draw cards. I want to steal your card. No. No. Wait. Yeah, because they played Rune Orb Ignite. So that's definitely an ice block, isn't it? This problem. Wrong frost spells. Brett, thank you for the prime. I don't understand how this deck wins games of Hearthstone. Uh, usually it doesn't. But I don't understand how that's a valuable contribution to chat. Alright. You know what? Ice block. Ice block. Okay. Okay. Hey, give me that. Hey, give me that.
Uh, I maybe should have just screamed this turn. Cindy D, thank you for the 100 bits. I want a hype train? I think you got it. The card. That actually ended up paying off to, uh... Wait a turn. I have a lot of cards though. I don't think I can Benny. This turn, I think I need to heal desperately. Well played. This game is certainly far from over, right? There's two more copies of Ice Block. needed that Thanos for the uh, Lash turn. Look for Lash here. Steal. But doing it this turn doesn't help me. One of the cards is Ray of Frost. Oh no. Oh, that just lost me the game. They still had the block in their deck. Oh? No, these are mage cards. Or priest cards, rather. Uh, Void Shard would have been better. I didn't count my mana properly because of the discounts. Congrats on winning that 90-10 matchup, friend. It's a tough job. But someone needed to be up to the task. Fortunately, fortunately it was the opponent. Bring victory. Down. 
Pray it's not uh, combo and keep the bunny. Let's start stealing their combo in case it is combo. Got a Benny off today? Uh, yes, despite the person saying sadly not. I have, in fact, gotten men multiple Benedictus off today. So. Seems weird to answer a question you do not know the answer to. Uh, I don't have taunts, so that's a problem. But for this, we'll just race them down with their own deck. They have armor gain stuff, right? Yeah, like that. Like cards go face. Actually, I do have a taunt now. <laughs> so that's actually pretty good for me to get that in deck. Scream, unlikely to be terribly relevant. Let's see what they've got for me. Claw and Savager. Armor gain helps. Hopefully they don't have Oaken summons here. They did keep a lot of their hand, but they've also played all of those cards. Ouchie. That loot hoarder and um, dead ringer die? No, this is a dead ringer. I've had two. Yeah, I've had another reliquary, so I think I want the reliquary back. I go like this. this. Problem is going to be the guff, but I can scream that into their deck and then try and steal it with Benedict. They're not progressing it very quickly, at least. But that'll change after the uh, secure the deck next turn. I think I want a card from their deck. Not necessarily that one. Oh, <laughs> I was just about to commend the opponent for not leaving the guff in hand, but, uh...
just consider it. Dead a couple ways. It's not likely I'm dead. Is it? I'm taking like 12. Nobody messes with my friends. Old, old, no savagery, no savagery. They're attacking the guff. Oh my god. I could also raise dead into guffs. the light. Okay. I want to save this in case I hit a savagery. I don't think they're running any more minions though, so maybe it just goes face. But the fact that I corrupted this was a pretty big deal. What? Okay, I guess it. Okay, it didn't matter. But we're doing. Oh! <laughs> oh my god. This is devastating. Oh man, I didn't even I didn't even start this stupid game with Seance in my deck. All right, more guffs. Come on, one time, two times. <gasps> Nobody messes with my friends. Technically, we don't yet have lethal, so what I need to do is find the raised dead. Ugh, so unlucky. More guffs? Yep. <laughs> Kevin the bro, thank you for the 690 bits. Nice. They're not dead yet? True. Bear hug. <laughs> uh.
Easy game. Imagine calling my hysterical laughter after playing four guffs against Questline Druid as a priest. Fake. <laughs> what a giant loser. I hope you feel bad because you definitely should. Oh, this is the same idiot. So let's look at this person's message history because it's funny. Because it reveals how uh, how big dumb they are. 109. Quest would help this deck. 115. Raffle, don't poop yourself from that fake laugh. And additional obscenities. Who hurt you? Certainly wasn't me. I was going to let you live, but mods thought otherwise. My feelings were not hurt because you are, in fact, a baby brain child. All right. Uh, no quest line to steal this time. This is what almost two months of seed block does to a man. Uh, you're being too generous calling them a man, first of all. They're, in fact, a child. Not a, certainly not an adult. And uh, we've all had to suffer for that, and we're not reacting in that same manner. Man-child is the correct word? Well, we don't know their gender. We just know that they're a child. Kevin the bro, thank you for the 100 bits. Them child? Just a child is probably fine. Think we're spending too much time on idiots? Probably, but it's amusing. It's good content. I'm enjoying myself, so. Not sure if or how I can win this, other than maybe it's Mechathune and I shuffle a bunch of trash into their deck. I know they have one alignment in their deck. So let's look for a scream. <laughs> Am I allowed to laugh now? Oh, because I'm going to anyway. It, it, do you not have any sense of irony in calling me toxic with the message that you just shouted at me? Oh, it's giants.
Giants is beatable, it is very much so. Especially without a Lothab. Although they could have one uh, on the backswing here. Yeah. Are they still here? For amusement, yeah. I, I gave them a chance to redeem themselves, but they couldn't, couldn't sort it out. Good. Um... Probably do need to uh, bump them into each other just so that I don't lose to um, been way too greedy, but I need so I need to not continue to be. Uh, that was kind of bad after the palm reading. I should have saved the palm reading, but I panicked at the end. Not looking good for old Raffle. Job done. None can stand uh -oh. Playing hand space. This just draws me scream every time. Same thing. Oh, thanks for the mana. Is there just randomly a Megathun in here as well? Oh. They're looking for the, uh, the Battlemaster. And 
Lead away versus Gul'dan. Nope. You have better. So, car a viable win condition in classes other than priest. Um, no, but also that's partially because it's not a viable win condition in priest. Well, we found all the uh, <laughs> warlocks. <laughs> if anything, Hakar is probably a more viable, or was a more viable win condition in Druid than it ever was in Priest. Like, Hakar Druid was actually a legitimate burst game plan with Tog. Matt Damon Hunter. Mm. I want a one drop, like a reliquary or a crystalline. Palm reading is fine too, I suppose. I'm sorry, what? Uh, what did I just get myself into? <laughs> Greetings. Shaman Quest was not too powerful and wild to be nerfed. Do you agree? I do, but it wasn't nerfed or wild, so it's okay. I don't know what I want yet. Maybe an insight? Yeah. I want to save all of my steel cards for after the Cthulhu gets into their deck. I feel like all of the Americans are revealing themselves in chat right now. <laughs> if you don't eat the crust of a pizza, you definitely should because it's extraordinarily wasteful not to. Even if it doesn't taste as good as the rest of it, like throwing away food is kind of gross. More gross, in fact, than uh, eating crust. Crust is the best part. That's taken it a little bit too far. But I admire your, uh, <laughs> your effort. Crust is awesome. I I mean I don't I wouldn't go that far. I mean, <laughs> crust is so disgusting here in America. We shove cheese into it and other ridiculous things, and then wonder why we have an obesity epidemic. <laughs> you cannot. Thank you for the hundred bits. The carny walks into a bar. The bartender says we don't serve carnies here. The carny looks around and says, "Well, this is no fair." <laughs> oh. Thicker thin crust, uh, thin crust. I like like the whole point of crust on pizza is the a vehicle for getting sauce and toppings into your face, sauce, cheese, and toppings into your face. Like, I want to limit the barrier between my face 
and the sauce, cheese, and toppings. Crust on homemade pizza really is the best part? Well, I mean, because you can make it actually taste good. You save the dipping sauce for the crust, or did you use it on the pizza itself? I feel like a good pizza doesn't need dipping sauce, but thank you for the 420 bits. What would Cheesemonger say? I think Cheesemonger would be proud of me. I would hope. Let's get rid of that stupid uh, watch post and uh, bring back some minions. Certainly ain't easy being cheesy. <laughs> Hunt goes on. For no Pleasure doing business. We can all agree that people who cut off the crust of sandwiches are savages. I mean, it's the same thing, right? Like, I don't really want to eat the crust either, but I'm not going to waste it. No. Oh, also bad. I taste. Where do you live? I live in my house. Got one Cthulhu piece in play. Didn't have any minions for that, did I? Needed some healing. My deck, no. But really, never had new Cthulhu played against me. It's very rare because it's very slow. Oh. 
one of the Thanos off the bat. Ian, thank you for the $5 tip in your off coin. Pizza is the best kind of food. Brings so many emotions out of people. It's the only food where something delicious on it, if you put something delicious on it, like pineapple with a very controversial complimentary meat, like ham, people get so angry they want to commit a felony assault. <laughs> True. I'm glad we have this discussion about pizza. Do your best to discuss. Do your best not to waste food and, jeez, the formatting here is difficult. Do your best, everyone, not to waste food, and if you have excess, donate to your local charity so they can help those in need. Remember to compost your excess veggies if your community allows. That's all fantastic advice. Uh, the opponent is trying to kill me, I found out. Which is alarming. Joke's on you, my hand is terrible. Or are they just trying to get Curtis down? My quest, my well, they found Curtis, but I also got my Prime. Pleasure doing business. Don't forget to use your Twitch Prime. On your favorite Twitch streamer. Lost one, thank you for the prime. I didn't <laughs> I didn't think that actually worked. Mega spook! Right, they do have ten cards left. I don't have Benedictus though. But they can't silence this, so they gotta go through it the hard way, right? What's that? No. You can't target it. Unless it's a minion. That's a minion. I will break your body. They're getting close though. Wait, did they put the uh Cthune in their deck yet? They have one more piece, right? Need the eye? I kind of figured that was a silence, given how long they were thinking about that turn. Scream? Ice cream? It gives them a new Curtis, but it gives us the possibility to get our own. Thune is in their deck now. <gasps> Pleasure doing business. They played cards. It's my one weakness. Are 
Okay, please kill the Curtis. Thank you. I think they're gonna draw it, though. It, they would have to get so unlucky not to have it. And it's gonna cost, what, like, four mana? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Somebody want to clip that? <laughs> oh. If only they didn't play cards. I think I'm going to call it there, though. I don't think it's going to be possible to top that, and uh, I'll probably be going longer tomorrow since... Uh, the patch will come out. Uh, Vault one. I think I did get your sub, but thank you again if I missed it. Thanks everyone for watching. We'll be back tomorrow with the patch. Um, hopefully that'll make things a little bit more tolerable, and I won't have to concede to everyone. Thanks for watching, everyone, and I'll see you tomorrow. In the meantime, stick around. I'm going to send you over to Hobbs, and you can continue having some fun. So, see you later.